There are so many factors that influence how far a ball travels, and one of them is weather. In Seattle and Houston, we're talking about two different climates, and those climates could change the game. He drives that one deep to right field. On its way, and it is gone! A home run is a knock-it-out-of-the-park feeling, and it can be influenced by factors outside of the park. From a stadium to the batting cages, air temperature, humidity, and other factors can change how far a ball flies. So the MLB set a new rule this year. The humidor is, for the first time this season, being used by all 30 major league clubs. This is the first season all ballparks are storing their baseballs in controlled climates. 70 degrees and 57% humidity, says University of Illinois retired professor of physics Alan Nathan. Using a humidor, you're really evening things out, not only from one stadium to another, because virtually they're all the same, but also from one season to another. Even with the control, the distance of ball travels can change due to the weather. If the ball is stored in a humid environment, it absorbs water, gets a little heavier, affects the bounciness of the ball. Similarly, when it's in a dry environment, it's uh, a little bit lighter and uh, the bounciness is also different more bounces. So how would a humidor impact a game in Seattle versus Houston? In these warm and dry Seattle conditions, a humidor would likely increase the humidity of a ball, causing the ball to not go as far when hit. In a warm and humid place like Houston, storing the ball in a humidor would likely decrease the humidity, causing the ball to go farther when hit, opening the door for more home runs. But there are other factors at play, like a roof and air conditioning in Houston. The controlled 73 degrees at Minute Maid Park will actually likely keep Houston and Seattle at about the same temperature, so the weather actually would not cause major differences in the games this week. Sends one high and deep to right field. Leah Pizzetti, King 5 News.